Good morning. I just wanted to give a little bit of background um, how Love Your Neighbor Maternity Home got started. I, um, I've i always had a heart for the unborn and have volunteered at crisis pregnancy centers, have um, attended fundraisers for crisis pregnancy centers. And just before COVID, I heard Abby Johnson speak. And Abby Johnson said, you know, we can't just say we're pro-life. We, we need to do something, among many other things. Um, Abby Johnson, if you don't know, she wrote the book Unplanned. And um, if you don't know her story, read the read that book. It's, it's wonderful. She has a wonderful story of how she came to be a pro-life advocate. Um, but all, I, I, so I came home after hearing Abby speak, and I thought, what can we do? What can we do? And I remember reading the book, The Hiding Place by Corey Ten Boom. And um, Corey Ten Boom and her family hid Jewish people from the Nazis and um, at great risk to themselves, of course. And her family did end up being found out and being put in prison, concentration camps, work camps. And Corey Ten Boom was the only one who survived. But I thought, I. I can't hide babies like Corey Ten Boom did with the Jewish people. So what can I do? And then, you know, it came to me that we have to do something for the mothers. The mothers often feel backed into a corner. They feel alone. They feel, I'm alone. I can't do this by myself. And the idea of a maternity home was planted. Um, now it's, been working we've been working for two or three years we, we're nonprofit we are um, getting ready to to look for property and to um, prayerfully with God's guidance and God's help we will open up um, soon it's it's a beautiful um, it's it's a it's going to be a beautiful home it's going to be um, directed by God and um, I believe that women that come there and their babies will be deeply blessed by this home. So I thank you for your time. And um, if you'd like, you can visit our website at loveyourneighbormaternityhome.com um, and learn more. Thank you. Bye-bye.